manager, friend, brother, construction worker. Vic, show them what's going on here. The What we have here is, over time, this is level, but the sand has washed out and it's created this thing that's kind of, you go walk around in bare feet, you could stub your toes bad. We're gonna lay these level again and then fill in the joints with sand. It's a real construction worker. He's got the cigar hanging out. This is like, not, this is second nature to this him. Is, this is what I do. Lucy won't let me do it because she says I fuck everything up, but she trusts Russell, not me. We can't deal with each brick individually, so we're gonna pull all of them out because it's a lot, it's very easy to get your hand in here now and we'll just start to level them and come all the way back to the last piece and get that level too. So let's just, and you can see in here, Vic, that they actually had the gravel underlayment and they didn't put the crushed stone over it and it washed out. Manager, friend, brother, construction worker. You better believe it. This one give you a little trouble, Russ? This one is what we like to call the rabble rouser. You okay, Russ? Is the heat getting to you? you? Can't stand the heat, Vic. You gotta get out of the kitchen. Yeah. Of course, the sun has to be right here. Couldn't be shade, right? Couldn't be shade. So we pulled them all out. And now we're gonna start right here and get our level. And we're gonna use sand. And we know it's low in the front. So we're gonna put the sand in here. And here we go. Okay, you wiggle it around a little bit. You use the rubber mallet. Because it's not gonna damage anything, right? Right. Okay. So that's a little high. So we're just gonna get the back end out a little bit. Okay, bring a little around. And that one should be set. We got all the stones in. We're gonna put in the sand now and fill the joints because that was a problem too, you know? You know, we're not gonna, we're not gonna dilly dally. You can't put on too much. It's a dilly dally? What if you dally dilly? You know, you don't want to do any dallying. Sometimes the dilly is all right, but you know, you just go back and forth until it fills these holes. Some of these holes are, are kind of deep. And so, you know, you got to work it in in order to get them full. So what you do with the water is it's called the dick test, right? Right. I'm going to put the hose on and if it's hardened, I'm going to shoot it in your dick. Right. If it's hard enough to make you go, Oop, then that means it's too hard. It'll wash the sand out. Sure. But if it makes it go, you know, ah, oh, that means. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, it's too hard. Now we go to something very light, a very light mist. You don't even feel it. Ah. Oh. Exactly. It's like when they water the infield at Yankee Stadium. Very similar, except completely different. Right. Very similar, except completely different. Mr. Sandman. Doo -doo -doo. Sandman, Sandman. There's gonna be times where you might catch a little hole, but you can see in the rest of your thing, it's washed away right. uh, over time. So we did our first watering. Hopefully it's really getting the sand down into the cracks. <coughs> when it dries. I think you're choking on some of that sand. We'll sweep it around again. Keep filling in what we gotta fill in. And then should be the end. Okay. I'm sure we're going to get comments from all the construction guys of what we did wrong. I don't know if there's any other way to do it other than using contractor sand. It has more binding, but you had sand, play sand. Hey, you kick the fucking kids out, you grab the fucking sand. You got it all level now. We got it all level. Well, Russ, another job well done. Thank you. Yeah, that was a good little project, man. That was a good project. You did a good job. Thank you. Well, we just got to do the rest of it now.